Hello friends, today we will discuss about update query in MySQL. So first we will go for the update syntax, then we will see the update with where clause, then we will talk about how to update all rows in the table, then we will talk about a bulk update. In, in that particular we will discuss about update using a case statement and then we will talk about update with order by and limit. So let us begin with first we will see the structure or we can say the syntax of update. So the syntax of update will be update table name set column equals to some value where column equals to some value. Now in this particular after set we have some column and value that will be the updated value in the table in place of the condition where we are going to change the value fine so here uh, let us begin with the very first query in update that is uh, suppose I want to change the name of a customer whose account number is 100 so the query for that will be update and then table name table name is deposit and then I have to write set C name equals to C name equals to uh, suppose I'm going to keep uh, change the name to say Anil fine where now I have to put where clause where ID or we can say uh, account number equals to one zero zero fine so let us see the result of this okay fine so the query has been executed now let us see the result so in table you can see at account number 100 we are having C name Anil fine okay now let us move further uh, the second thing that we have is how can we update all rows with a single value so in place of having where condition simply we have to write update uh, table name say deposit set and then I have to write C name uh, suppose I'm going to give Mahesh fine so in all the rows the C name will become Mahesh fine so now let us execute the query so the query has been executed and let us see the result okay so in result we can find that uh, all C names are Mahesh fine now suppose I want to change the name of account number uh, 100 101 and 102 fine so this we will be able to do using case using case in uh, update query if you want to study the syntax of case if you want to study the working of case statement you can refer my video uh, in uh, uh, in the case in the select uh, uh, playlist fine so now let us move further uh, suppose I want to change the name of 101 102 and 103 fine so the query will be like update then table name that is deposit now what we want is we want to set name C name equals to now over here we will have case statement fine case what we want is account number when 100 at that point what we want to do is then suppose I want to put say Suresh fine when it's 101 then I want to put it as uh, say Nimesh and when it's 102 then I want to put say Jayesh fine and this case statement will be ended with and fine now 
I have to put where condition over here. If I'm not going to put where condition, if I'm not going to put where condition, then in that particular case, except 100, 101 and 102, all others row, in all other rows, the C name will become null. The C name will become null. Fine. So now let us see that. Uh, fine. So the query has been executed successfully. Now we have to see two results. One is where we have modified the value and the second one is where we have not modified the value. Fine. So here we have modified the value that is 101 Suresh, 101 Nimesh, 100 Suresh and 102 Jayesh. Apart from that, all other became null. That is why whenever we are going to change the value, whenever we are going to change the value, we also have to put, we also have to put where condition so that it, it should not modify the values in other uh, columns. Fine. So uh, this is uh, the example where we have not used the where clause. Now let us see uh, the query, same query using where clause, fine. Suppose uh, let me update the values of uh, C name. First deposit and then uh, uh, we'll have set and then C name equals to Anil. Fine. So this one is going to make all the C names like Anil. So here in table we can see all the C names are Anil. Now we want to update first three names and here we are going to put certain conditions. Fine. Without condition result we have already seen. So now let us have update then table name that is called deposit set c name equals to or here we'll put case statement so it will be like case over here account number when 100 zero zero, then it will be like uh, Mahesh when 101 then it will be like Jayesh and when 102 then It is like Suresh. Fine. And this one will be ended by using and still. And. Okay. Now I am going to put where condition. Where account number in 100, 101, 102. Fine. Now let us see the result of this. Fine. So the query has been executed. Now you can see it has modified first three rows only where account number is 101, 102 and 100. Uh, 100. Fine. Apart from that it has not modified the values in the C name. So this way we can have the difference in the with where clause and without where clause using case statement. Fine. Now let us move further. Uh, the next we have is uh, update with order by and limit. Update with order by and limit. Suppose uh, I'm having uh, all the names in. Uh, let me update all the names again. Update deposit set c name equals to anil fine okay so now all the 
rows contain C name Anil. Now I want to update first three uh, C names only. Fine. So I can write like update and then I have to write the table name that is deposit set C name equals to suppose I want to put it as Jayesh. Fine. And I'm going to write order by order by uh, account number and limit three fine now let us see the result of this so the query has been executed now let us see the result so it has uh, modified first three rows only it has not modified more than three rows fine suppose if i'm going to uh, order it in descending order say update then uh, deposit uh, then we have to write set c name equals to say mahesh order by uh, account number desc descending order and limit four so this one is going to this one is going to update last four rows this one is going to update last four rows fine so first it is going to order the uh, data according to account number and then it is going to update uh, the c name up to limit four if you want to study the limit function in detail then you can refer uh, the limit video in the select playlist fine so let us execute this query and let us see the result fine so the query has been executed now let us see the result so here you can see last four rows uh, has been updated so this way we have studied the basic uh, structure of update how we can update all rows how we can update the data in bulk using case and the last that we have studied is up studied is update with order by and limit thank you very much for today and please don't forget to subscribe the channel